the Japan tour was one of those experiences that um, you know I really enjoyed. Um, we went to different places, of course, and uh, based on the number of activities that we did, um, talk about performances, talk about the cultural experience, talk about the uh, the, the food, talk about um, the interaction that they had with um, the other students and the people in Japan. I think uh, that was something very new, um, not only to the students, but also to me. The biggest performance we had, they were sudden, all of a sudden put in this university grand hall, which can accommodate 1,000 audience. And at first they were so scared and they didn't know what to do. And they found all these university and high school students, they were like much, much better instrumentalists than them. So they really freaked out and they, they were not like their usual selves. They, they were like quiet and then they were polite and everything. But then when the stage uh, started and they were told to just have fun and enjoy, now they put on their lessons, African uh, shukas, and then they went and danced and danced and danced. And that brought to Japanese people, they, that brought something different, completely different that they didn't have in their culture. So the, the real interaction of culture took place. And I think we learned from each other, like our kids learned that how they practice so hard and they are really good at their performances. But then on the Japanese side, they learned to really enjoy music and live music, perform and dance and all that. Yeah, so I think it was really good uh, performance that we had. on the train to sit. <laughs> there was this shopping mall that was across uh, the road from uh, across the railway Nini, uh, from our uh, accommodation and they went there and then they were so impressed they were like it was just one of the local uh, shopping mall that is not like particularly big or anything but then to them it was like the biggest shopping mall that they would ever see in life and they said this is this is bigger than the, the biggest shopping mall in Africa so they started taking group photos This church is some of the churches, they prepare a rice cake to celebrate Easter. Um, they, so they were invited to pound on this rice cake and in, in a big bowl that is made of stone. Um, they have this wooden stick and then you put uh, special rice that, that is used to make for rice cake. That is like a stick kind of rice. So they were invited to pound on them and pound on them. And then some of our children were like really, really afraid at first. Like they, they were like shy and then they didn't bring out some of this African in them. They were just like so politely, like chup, chup. And then, and then they were told, no, you have to pound it. You can't, you can't make rice cake if you're doing like this. So, so eventually they went, wah, wah. In terms of food, uh, they were very particular about what they were eating. Um, they did not want to try out new things. They were busy looking for McDee's and they're looking for um, KFC and Starbucks and you know, those brands that everybody knows. But then, um, interesting enough, towards the end, they learned to accommodate um, the culture, the meals, and even the use of chopsticks. who have come to Christ in, um, um, uh, over at the tour and I remember one lady was so thankful that we were able to share with them and tell them that they did not come by chance. They are not just something that um, was a, a freak event of nature and that's what was the cause of coming um, to God or rather that was the cause of their, their life and their life really does mean something and there is much more after death. 
and so we need to continue to share this and I, I believe the, Christa, the, the, the students themselves also grow in that part of the tour. And I pray that uh, we continue to just share that in more and more tours. Let the tour not just be academic, but let it, uh, all the um, ethos of the school, let all parts of, of what we stand for in St. Andrews stand and be in our tours. And I believe the Japan tour was able to bring that.